Can you believe that Tesla stock is about to go ballistic? Although some analysts do not share this opinion, most Tesla enthusiasts believe that this is entirely possible to happen. You probably would not want to miss this info. With a lot of promising, innovative projects from the company, Tesla enthusiasts are confident that Tesla stock will surely explode. Although with stocks, it is not really that easy to tell. Today, you will find out why Tesla stock is about to go ballistic. Tesla, a clean energy company, continues to confound market analysts and investors alike. In 2020, headlines like, Tesla stock price goes ballistic, broke the web. Yet again in 2021, similar headlines surfaced which pretty much say the same thing. Tesla shares have gone ballistic. Now in 2022, people are once again talking about Tesla stock about to go ballistic. Although Tesla stock has had a rough year, sliding about 16% year to date, the stock's year to date return would have been much worse if it wasn't for a sharp recovery over the last several months. During this period, the stock is up more than 30%, which compares to a 6% gain for the S&P 500. According to a Tesla enthusiast, there are three major reasons why Tesla stock may be about to go on a massive run to replace Apple as the world's most valuable company. Of course, this might seem like too much of a stretch for some, but many Tesla fans believe that the leading EV company will be able to do just that. The first reason is that Tesla has been poised for greatness, so to speak, with all the preparations on different aspects of the company in the last several years, one of which is the recently opened Austin and Berlin gigafactories that aim to aid the production of the Shanghai plant, especially since the said factory has limited production numbers due to several restrictions because of the zero COVID policy imposed by the government. Also, not a small feat is the several products Tesla Tesla has been preparing to launch in the last several years, including the 4680 batteries, the Semi, and Cybertruck, which has had an endless number of orders and reservations since last year. Many believe that the next quarter's earnings result will show a significant improvement which will make everyone happy, except of course those who wish the company will not do well. Although there had been issues in the production of the 4680 cells, given that they are a brand new form factor that simply didn't exist until Tesla invented them, they are now scaling production with the aid of the dedicated production line in Austin. Moreover, Tesla's perspective is not to rely only on its 4680 productions. Cell partner Panasonic sent the first 4680 sample cells to Tesla and started its own pilot production in Japan in May. Last week, it became known that the battery factory for series production will probably be built in Kansas. Samsung's SDI is building its 4680 pilot line in Chinoan with series production reportedly to take place later in Malaysia. In terms of production, the Fremont plant is geared to make a run rate of 700,000 cars per year despite the seemingly awkward layout and the relatively small factory size. The Shanghai factory's new upgrades in the upcoming extension should be good for 1.2 million cars per year, making it one of the biggest car factories in the world. Berlin and Austin each have the capacity to run at about 500,000 cars per year once they have properly settled in all aspects business-wise. Once established, they can add up to a production level of 2.9 million cars per year. Another reason is Tesla CEO Elon Musk's Twitter venture seems to be coming to an end, whatever the end may be. It can be noted that when this news first broke, many were concerned that Musk was losing, or at least going to lose, focus on Tesla. Now that it looks like it will come to a conclusion soon, investors collectively sigh in relief. Finally, the last reason for a bullish stance on Tesla stems from the fact that Tesla's competitors are far behind in the race. According to Sandy Monroe, an auto manufacturing expert, there are no competitors to Tesla. Other experts appear to share the sentiment that Tesla continues to have no competition since no other company has reached volume production of battery electric vehicles besides Tesla. Make sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons for more of this content. Despite a flood of capital and EV companies showing up, Tesla maintains its lead. If there was an actual competitor to Tesla, it could be BYD, but it's clear Tesla is the only profitable EV company, according to Tesla Economist. According to some, everyone is so far behind and Tesla is so far ahead. Everyone thought that what Tesla was doing was repeatable and replicable. However, Tesla has moved far ahead and has a long wait list for all its vehicles, even before the 4680 Model Y from Giga Texas. Other EV makers are still stuck 5 to 10 years behind. Experts believe that Tesla has no competition because of its vertical integration, excellent financials, advanced manufacturing plant, 
no dealership model, and industry-leading in-car software. They further stated that no other companies are making and selling electric vehicles similar to Tesla. Even though only 2% of the global vehicle fleet is electric today, this number is expected to significantly increase in the future. When asked about her thoughts on large corporations competing with Tesla in electric vehicle production, Kathy Wood, Star Investor and ARK Invest CEO said, They are failing miserably. According to her, they are failing on the battery technology front as they are not writing down the consumer electronics cost curve which Tesla decided to run down. She noted that at one point, people made fun of Tesla for putting cell phone batteries at the bottom of the car, and that the same phone batteries tend to explode. Wood explained that Tesla uses lithium-ion pouch, which is much more costly than Tesla's consumer electronics batteries. Thus, if companies decide to compete with Tesla, they'll have to sell every electric vehicle at a loss and at the same time they're losing their internal combustion engine business. Wood said that the reason why Tesla is so far ahead of its competitors is that those companies have just gotten started. She said that what they have delivered so far are cars that don't even meet the range or other metrics of Tesla's Model S. Other manufacturers need an almost similar amount of investment in their EV R&D, battery and manufacturing plants to the amount of money Tesla invests in R&D and factories. It's because an EV and a gasoline vehicle look identical on the outside, but it's entirely different inside. EV requires new R&D and manufacturing for the electric motor, battery, powertrain, control computer, and much more. Moreover, Tesla has been developing and improving its vehicles for over a decade and has more experience than any other vehicle manufacturers. In fact, even the newest EV companies, such as Lucid and Rivian, failed to emulate Tesla's business model. Rivian and Lucid's negative gross margins are staggeringly high for a company. That said, Tesla is in great financial shape compared to other companies. Kathy Wood said that there are three other advantages Tesla has. The first is batteries. Second, they have their own artificial intelligence chip. Wood said that when their analyst James Wang, who worked at NVIDIA, an artificial intelligence company for eight years, looked at the specs of Tesla's chip, he was in awe. Wang said that Tesla is four years ahead of any other auto manufacturer in terms of the specs out there on chip technology. This is important in going autonomous with electric, which is Tesla's goal. Going autonomous has everything to do with artificial intelligence projects, and the winner will have the most data and the highest quality data. Tesla has 14 billion miles of real-world driving data today, and the closest competitor, Waymo, only has 20 million. Finally, Tesla's advantage over other companies is that it is the only auto manufacturer still that delivers over-the-air software updates to modify performance. Although quite a few believe that Tesla does not stand a chance against the big, established car companies, others are confident that the company will be worth trillions by the end of the decade. In 2013, Elon said that Tesla's goal is to accelerate the automotive industry's transition toward electric vehicles. He shared, Our goal is not just to become a big brand or compete with Honda Civic, but rather to advance the cause of electric vehicles. Musk said that they are just going to continue making more and more electric cars and driving the price point down until the industry is fully electric. For more Tesla stock content, visit our channel and watch our other videos.